Developing now, there is an active warrant out for a former American Legion post commander accused of stealing. Prosecutors say he stole money from the same post he ran. Our Candace Hare joins us live from the East End with the very latest on this. Yes, Rob, it's all detailed in these documents that show that Michael McKinnis has been indicted on one count each of theft, misuse of credit cards, and forgery. They say it all took place with funds that were taken from this American Legion post in East End, over which he was formerly the commander. This is where veterans like myself and my fellow brothers and sisters can come and we have the camaraderie. We all have something in common and we all put our lives on the line for this country. A vital post for many wartime veterans in Hyde Park and Mount Lookout is facing an uncertain future. Our financial situation is very grave. This after an audit showed $98,000 were misused. The person accused of embezzling those funds? The Post's former commander, Mike McKinnis. So he is using the Legion debit card to make these fraudulent transactions. Not only for, obviously he was making transactions for the Legion, but a majority towards his own personal good. The indictment shows McKinnis is also accused of forging a bank statement. The thefts taking place between May 2019 and September 2022. Among the items current post commander Danny Brownfield says McKinnis bought with that money were Notre Dame football game tickets and Coney Island season passes. Brownfield tells me McKinnis was very well liked during his tenure as commander and these accusations coming to light has been difficult to digest. It's hard to put that onto a balance beam, right? I mean, a lot of people see the good in Mike and a lot of people still see the good Mike, right? But this has tarnished that. For now, Brownfield says the Post is working to rebuild in hopes of creating a brighter financial future. I'd like, you know, for everybody to, to rally together, veterans, um, you know, the community, and continue to support us as they have through this tough and trying time. Now at last check, McKinnis has not yet been arrested. This is a developing story as we learn more. We'll share it with you here on Fox 19 Now, our website and our free mobile app. Reporting live, Candace Hare, Fox 19 Now. Candace, thank you very much. New tonight, Cincinnati Police